how do you feel about the idea about getting paid for treatments? <laughs> Can this happen? Oh my God. In our lifetime. Yeah. You know, it's a lot of work that goes into treatment. There's a lot of uh, writing and feedback and building the yep. treatment, image selection, Getting all on that. calls. Getting on calls. His, which yeah. is the most... Yeah. daunting stuff it's exactly very anxiety driven yeah it'd be amazing to change that system and process where you know the director and production company gets compensated yeah. even just a little bit it shows a level of respect yeah. for for work you know and for idea generation you're, you're definitely helping the agency as well fine-tune their own concept right can you mention what you uh were talking about earlier in terms of the creative sort of getting snuck into like you didn't win a job but some of the creative, without naming names, obviously, mm. um, when you saw something that was like very clearly from your treatment <laughs> that yeah. you did it when, you know what I mean? For sure. I mean, every director goes through this as well, yeah. where you you pitch an idea um, and you're offering a lot of different ideas, you know, whether it's music, whether it's location, casting, story yeah. beats, whatever it is. And sometimes you see those little details in the final spot. Yeah. So that, that eclectic, you know, even though song, you didn't win, yeah. yeah, the song choice that you put in there, or that that very, you know, uh, exciting story element you you add into the into the script, and it suddenly appears yeah. in the final spot that you don't win. It's, it's, not it's like always interesting. It's not yeah. like they're taking the idea of like uh, whip pans or something. No, you know? it's like specific, very specific. Sometimes. This has probably happened to me like half a dozen times. Really? Yeah, <laughs> I, I would say over over the last like six seven years for sure. Um, and sometimes you know maybe it's not even intentional. Maybe like they already had that idea or they already had you know. And then yeah. me saying that scene idea was affirmation for them. Mm -hmm. So I'm not saying they're actively stealing. No one's actively stealing. Maybe subconscious, yeah. but I'm sure there are, you know, they love that song that I, that I offered yeah. up and they're, they're going with that. Have you, I've also experienced this where they bring three directors into pitch and then it just goes away all of a sudden for everybody. You know what I mean? It sometimes it feels like they, like the idea isn't cooked enough and almost like they're going out mm. for ideas sometimes, you know, mm. without maybe the intention of mm. completing the whole thing because it's, it is a little bit, it's unfair for the production companies as well. For sure. You know? It's a lot of free work put in from the producers. They, they're, they're, you know, bidding, they're going back exactly. and forth with the agency producer yeah. trying to get the budget, you know, under their level as well. And at the same time, in tandem, you have the whole creative team, the designers, yep. the director, everyone working together to make this thing, offering all these ideas and all this yep. time and effort. And, uh, you know, they may never even show the client your treatment ever. Right. So yeah. it's, it's a funny, it's a weird, funny game, I hope evolves to, to where, you know, the agencies maybe or clients um, can compensate a little bit, even just a tiny bit to every production company pitching. Yeah. Every, you know, everyone is paid a little bit out of their giant budgets 